ArcGIS Excalibur allows for users to conduct a wide variety of image-based workflows, including those that are pre-planned. A pre-planned workflow can be accomplished through the notion of an imagery project. An imagery project is a way for users to assemble and organize all resources required to complete an image-based task in a single location. I can view a list of imagery projects within my organization that are available to me to gain an initial understanding about each project, such as a title, a description, who created the project, when that project was created, and what type of project it is. A project type helps tell the application which tools to surface for the user to have a more focused and streamlined workflow to fulfill their imagery task. I can also view additional information about each project by viewing its project details. This provides information as what imagery is associated to the project, what observation layers are being utilized, and what web map is being leveraged within the imagery project. As the project owner, I can add or remove capabilities to my imagery project at any given time. This includes making textual edits to the name, instructions, or summary, or even adding or removing observation layers based on my task at hand. So let's open up this observation imagery project type focused around construction activities and take a closer look. A set of instructions helps guide users through the image-based task and can be recalled at any given time. In this instance, I'm tasked with collecting and recording observations of any active construction occurring within the highlighted area of interest. Reference layers are overlaid on top of the image to give the user additional supporting information which can be toggled on or off or interacted with at any given time. This capability helps unify the traditional geospatial and imagery views into a single view experience for the user. The orange area of interest helps me as the analyst stay focused to a specific area as opposed to spending time scanning the entire image. I can utilize the time slider to view any previous observations that may have been collected in my area of interest. This helps to make any future observations by knowing what was previously collected. Since my task is to collect and record on any active construction within the highlighted area of interest, I can utilize my observation tools to begin my work. A palette of icons displays based on the observation type and in this instance, based on construction status. After identifying active construction within my view, I can click directly on the palette and click directly on the image to collect my observation. The observation gets collected in both the image space and map space for further frame of reference. A form display is allowing me as the user to manually add additional contextual information about the observation. Domains and dropdowns are utilized to simplify the user's workflow. In addition to the manual fields, there are a set of fields that get auto-populated for the user, which are key to observation-based workflows. These fields help connect the observation to a specific image to allow for traceability of observations within an organization. Therefore, this observation is now tied to this specific image, Within this imagery project, it was collected at this date and time by this user at this location at this specific map scale. Now as an organization, I can nearly recreate the environment from when an analyst made an observation for traceability purposes. Once all information is filled out, I can submit the observation which gets written to the system of record and can be utilized by others within my organization in downstream analysis. An example of this is utilizing an operations dashboard where the observations that have just been collected are immediately updated and available to reflect their current status. 
As you can see, the observation just collected over the one facility is now immediately displaying in my operations dashboard and can be utilized for further analysis.